What is up guys, we are back with some more Pokemon Shield Nuzlocke and we just got the 7th gym badge from Spike Month and we sadly lost two team members. We lost Checkmate and we lost Squeeze. But luckily uh, we have on two new team members. We have uh, Jack Frost the Snome. Snome? Snom? Snome? I'm thinking it's Snome. And then we also have... Uh, Emil, the Drapion. So I'm hoping these two are going to be good additions to the team. Oh my gosh. <laughs> uh, we're going to focus on taking you out. <laughs> so, right now I'm not really, I'm not really happy with, uh, I guess how my team is looking in my opinion. I feel like we really are losing out on some uh, physical firepower from losing Squeeze and Checkmate. I was really looking forward to Checkmate as well. So, uh, I guess now we can switch in Bougie Queen. Switch in uh, a mill. I'm actually thinking about putting Earthquake on a mill. I feel like that would be a pretty smart decision to do. Is Maractus also poison type? I can't remember, to be honest. I feel like it's grass and poison, but... Oh well. We just won't find out from that. So now we have to travel to, uh... Hammerlock to face the final gym leader. It's gonna be a double battle. I, so far, I'm not sure... How I want to go about that. I was thinking I was going to do Shimmy Sham and Nikki. But then I was thinking about the fact that Nikki has a big, uh, a big flaw against ground types. Or at least ground moves. So all I know is that. Oh, I don't think this was a battle, right? <laughs> But I just don't think that'll be the best option. I don't know if I should do Tank Buster with Shimmy Sham or I should just have Drapion out there with uh, Tank Buster just so we can have some very physical moves out there. But I know that I'll be wanting to change up the the type, uh, the, the weather because I believe the last gym's weather well, he's supposed to be dragon, but he just changes up the weather and all that stuff. So it'd be pretty beneficial to use Shimmy Sham just to have Rain Dance out there. And then obliterate his uh, Torkoal. Ah. Got yourself a Dew Blade or a Dub Blade. Sweet. <laughs> Took that one out in an instant. I totally forgot to give Jack Frost the Soothe Bell. Um, who did he? Who did he say I was switching to? <laughs> I don't know which one it said it was switching to. I'm like, if it's if it's a Steel type, then yeah, we'll send out Tank Buster. Oh, Passimian. I'm a normal type. Oh, wait. Oh, wait, what? Wait, wh why was that super effective? I don't like how that went. <laughs> I 
Oh my, did he predict my switch out? Bro. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> it's like he just knew I was gonna switch to Shimmy Sham. I don't know, that's crazy. I was about to say, if this past Simeon lives, like, this is an OP past Simeon. Poltergeist. I believe that's Ghost. I don't know if it's just straight Ghost or if it's like Dark Ghost, I don't know. Okay, straight Ghost. Oh, and we got the Cricks. I got the scope lens on uh, Drew, uh, Emil. I wish I had the sniper ability on it though. That would have made it even more clutch of a Pokemon to be using. But while I'm here, let me. Give you the Soothe Bell. And then we're just gonna heal all y'all up because y'all took a beating from that battle. I really wasn't, uh, I wasn't expecting that acrobatics on past Simeon when I did the switch out. Man, did I just, yep, I just healed them all up <laughs> right when I could have just been going straight to a Pokemon Center. All that means is I just gotta buy more potions, basically. Oh yeah, that's right, I can buy more items. Gonna need some more of those, cause uh, there's still Pokemon I need to catch. Oh, wow, I just realized how much money I have. Like, god dang. I don't remember what he was selling, if I want anything. He has some nice stuff, actually. Uh, I don't know if I want these. Those would be nice to put on somebody. I don't know who, but somebody can get that potentially later on. I don't know why I'm like wasting time doing all this, but... Uh, I think we're just gonna. I think we'll just do Shimmy Sham and Tank Buster out there. I know that he's probably gonna have like a move to deal with uh, Tank Buster, but at least it gives me time to set up uh, Shimmy Sham. What was that? Oh, dire hit. I find it crazy how I'd be missing a lot of items sometimes. Well, if it isn't Blade, it sure is me. Okay, Professor, we barely interact with. All I know is I'm ready for this next gym challenge.
I don't even have anything to deal with dragon. Well, I have Snow, but Snow's not even evolved yet, so that doesn't even count. Go to where everybody challenges them. Not here, but the vault. Our fault. <laughs> we make you go somewhere else. Okay, that was a long load <laughs> for that. I'm actually wondering if my team is at a good level too, because I know... Uh, they like to do like a nice like level spike towards the end of the game, especially when it comes to like the Elite Four. I'm really mad I didn't use Slash uh, on Old Man Scun Tank. Like I was out here setting myself up basically. That's what I want. I want a Pelipper with Drizzle. The fact that we do, like, nothing to everything. <laughs> Either you're both gonna target Shimmy Sham, or you guys are gonna target Tank Buster, but... Oh no, you sped yourself up with Tailwind. Alrighty. Ouch. Oh man, are you both gonna take out Shimmy Sham? Oh, whew, sweet. Got worried for a second there, man. That drizzle uh, actually came in clutch though because of Shimmy Sham's ability. I think that went better than when I first fought these guys. I like how he has zero, zero x zero for like. Zero ten, zero ten zero. Oh, are they actually like letting me heal up my pokies? <laughs> They're like, yeah, we know it's unfair if we just have you fight them like that. Nine tails and tornadoes, so that means this is going to be a hot team. Oh, I used it on the wrong Pokemon. Should have used it on Tank Buster to lower his attack. One HP left. You're telling me y'all couldn't have just y'all couldn't have just let that one go.
Okay, now you're smart. Now you, you set it on both. I feel like Rain Dance should like get rid of burns. <laughs> that's just me. But that's also just because the fact that it shows like that flame animation. sure if I have burn heals but I might have berries that can cure the burns I don't know maybe maybe shimmy sham and tank buster is a good combo to go to go with for this uh, Oh, I have full heals. Oh, no, I, I bought some burn heals. I must have bought that like, at the beginning of the game. Because uh, I definitely don't remember buying any of that other stuff. So all that's left, really, is what? Hail? Yeah. And Ice King? How is that? What? I myself am thrown off by this one. Let's get rid of that hail though. Don't need to do an extra damage. I feel like that, uh, Hakama O is gonna do some damage. I like how even though he's not there, it still shows like an animation for it. <laughs> Should have taken out Obama Snow. If this takes out, uh, wow, of course. Of course it doesn't. I feel like the that ghost move has like priority. Oh, it doesn't. It's one of those just in case type things. Definitely doing a great job of lowering the damage I output. Wow. That's right, Razor Leaf has a high crit rate.
Yeah, I'm still kind of confused on what my strategy would be with uh, going up against its dragon Pokemon because I don't have Frostmoth. Well, I don't have Frostmoth yet, but I don't see it happening anytime soon too because I haven't even worked on the happiness for uh, for Snow. Would have been better to have Bougie Queen out there, most likely, though. But Bougie Queen is so, so nimble. See, I don't even know why y'all transport me here without healing up the squad. I don't know what y'all thought this was, or what was gonna go down. But this is definitely not it. Uh, maybe this is like the perfect time to teach somebody uh, Ice Fang, though. Oh, only you can learn Ice Fang. Mm. I guess we'll get rid of X-Scissors. I mean, I can always reteach X-Scissors later on. Uh, that'll be good to have when going up against Dark-type Pokemon. That's for sure. But let's hope this battle doesn't go horrible for us. I know he has that Duraludon that he's going to Gigantamax and I don't know what it has to do, uh, I guess, to mess up Tank Buster. But like I said, like Dark and Ghost type moves are pretty, pretty easy to learn on a lot of Pokemon. Okay, start off with the sandstorm. Yep. Knew it, he had something. Wow, that was a crit too, that did so much damage. Now I feel like I should have targeted the Flygon first. I don't think his Gigalith can do anything. Uh, this might be my best bet to take out his Flygon without losing Tank Buster. I don't want to lose Tank Buster. Tank Buster is pretty clutch. I don't know. Who I would replace him with too. Uh, I don't have any good ground or ghost Pokemon actually. I have Haunter, but uh, I can't even evolve Haunter. And then I also have uh, Carablast, I believe. And I can't do anything with Carablast. I definitely should have gave these guys Dynamax candy. Their health is a joke. I feel like I just need to keep Tank Buster out here while I 
destroy like the rest of his team. <laughs> I definitely need to do a better job with um, with upping Hydro Pump. I need to use some of those PP ups or PP max. Wow, and use Protect. But at least we can get some damage through. Because, uh, Sand Spit. Oh. Okay, that's, that's fine. That just means I gotta get rid of that again. But that's actually smart on their part because... Um, I have to run out of this move now, which I was going to use against, I was going to use against, uh, his Duraludon when it was Dynamaxed, or Gigantamaxed. I just don't want to give him any opportunity to make his... Pokemon any oh my gosh I totally forget like each time it takes damage it causes that that just means I'll have to rain dance uh, next turn then really like the only thing I can think of doing but one of these two guys is going down and I'm not sure who it might be shimmy sham if he targets shimmy sham but the best I can do is is use rain dance to I guess even the playing field for us, at least. I could potentially send out Nikki, have Nikki use Bubble Beam or something. Uh, no, that wouldn't even be that for, that effective, actually. Now I think about it. Uh, uh, yep. Oh wow, that didn't do that much, but it's going to raise its attack, that's for sure. This is like one of those perfect times to have, uh, <laughs> protect. just gonna heal up shimmy sham again <laughs> and I think that should be a GG oh you took out tank buster I don't know, I feel like this one's gonna give him like a choice on who to take out. <laughs> Either Oh, that's right, I totally forgot about uh about stealth rocks that he threw out. Oh man, now I gotta figure out who to replace Tank Buster with. Oh, and you brought the sandstorm back. Okay, now you're on our level, but you still have boosted stats, so... 
it's it's one of us that you're gonna have to take out I'm not sure who he's gonna take out <laughs> Stone it. Oh. I don't know why I have that like a default going to the bag. another member but we got the badge guys i guess that's all that matters in the end we didn't lose too many more members on the team but that was not how the, i expected it to go but i think uh i have another route um, I actually have Lake of Outrage I can go catch a Pokemon at. Which is probably what I will be going to do. Uh, I definitely need to get the team up. but And find that another new member. I just keep losing members each episode now. It's like back to back. So, uh, I don't know. Breaking Swipe. Uh, who would I put that on? I don't even know who I would put that on. But guys, I'm in this episode off here. Again, I'm about to update the team for you guys. Uh, hopefully it's a good team then. I need to do some more of the, the rating actually, because that's how I'm getting these EXP candies to level up everybody faster or at a faster rate I'll say um that's at least how I got a mill up and caught up in level the snow was already at level 41 I believe when I caught it uh either no snow was at a lower level I think and I think I initially was gonna have snow on the team and then I took snow away because I didn't see any use for snow but now I wish I now I kind of wish I put more into snow and that probably would have made that last battle a little bit easier at least starting out i probably could have had to take out that flygon pretty easily but like i said guys i'm in this episode off here make sure you leave a like for the video it helps out the video a lot also subscribe to my channel it helps out the channel a lot alert 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 new discord channel up so if you haven't joined yet feel free to join link is in the description it's for friends and fans that like to game together or if you're just a fan of the page, you can go in there, chat it up, give game suggestions, talk it over with other people about various stuff. It's a very laid back, chill environment, very welcoming. But guys, with that said, stay sharp. Later.